You know, I think embedded in all of these institutions, there has always been a tension between power and purpose, if I can put it that way. So on the one hand, there are institutions that were created by very powerful nations, both uh, with a view to their interests, but also with a view to common interests and ways that those institutions could enjoin a widening circle of countries into a system of cooperation that would ultimately advance all of their shared interests in a significant way. It's also a set of aspirational institutions that are very much values driven uh, in their way. There is always in that interplay a somewhat of a tension between the sovereignty that every country rightfully exercises and what they get from cooperation. My own view is that there's a false dichotomy that's often created between sovereignty and cooperation. One of the best ways to advance the sovereign interests of any country, including the United States, is by working with allies, working with other partners where you share common interests. And that's really how these institutions were created and what they're for. So I think it's a false choice and I think it's an unfortunate one if people make it.